Yo, what up and welcome to the cupboard and today I've got a question for you about routing the Samsung Galaxy S9. This is an international variant of the S9 Plus which you can route. The Snapdragon variant you can't route as yet, it's more of an exploit than a full on route so this version which I have you can route but I'm contemplating whether or not I should actually route the device and that's the question. In 2018, is there a real need to root your handset? Going back years when Android was in its infancy, I can understand why people used to root their devices. They wanted to mess around with Android on that deeper level while having that higher level of access, changing custom ROMs, messing around with the themes, icons, that kind of stuff. But nowadays, Samsung provides apps that you can theme their device, you can change icons, you can do a lot more customization nowadays out the box that you couldn't do before. And let's not forget the boring subject of backups. Samsung never used to provide cloud access so you could store your backups on there. We used to use something like Titanium Backup to back up the app's data as well as the entire phone so that if something went missing, we still had a copy of it locally. Or well, is that the reason that you still use root access? If you don't trust the cloud or the cloud companies, is that a good reason to root your device so you can keep a backup of your apps and data as well as the entire phone locally in your own possession where these cloud companies can't peek their eyes into what you have on your handset? And the big one for me is finance and banking applications. Because it's easy on the go to download your bank's application, log in, check your statements, pay some bills. It's very easy to do on the go on your smartphone without even logging into a computer. But is it worth losing the access if you root your device? Because chances are, if you root your device, your banking application may not work because it's considered a security flaw, which it is. So going back to the question, do I root the Samsung Galaxy S9 and lose that functionality? Do let me know in the comment section down below, what do you think? Do you use Root today in 2018? If so, what do you use it for? I could do a video either way just to show you how to do it, but is there a real need in 2018 to do it? As ever, if you're new, hit subscribe and hit that little notification bell. There's plenty more content coming up on here. Thanks for watching, have a wicked day, and I'll see you next time.